One thing about white supremacy, it kind of makes everybody in the world think they can minimize or demonize or just dismiss black men, their feelings or what you say as if you're hurt or you're mad or in some way you're insecure about something when in reality you just holding your nuts saying what you feel and what you believe. You know, and it's just funny, like being a black man, it's hard to really engage with people or talk to people because they so silly and always got something so silly and so negative to say to you because you have an opinion and you standing on what you believe and what you feel is if they should be able to dictate what you say or how you act or or their opinions have any validity in any way towards your feelings or how you act or what you want to say, you know what I'm saying? And that's why I just really hold my nuts on everything nowadays, because it's like with or without people, I'm still going to be a man and you're going to have to respect me as that, whether you like me or not, whether you agree with what I'm saying or not, you know what I'm saying? You can't minimize or invalidate me because I'm a black man or because you don't like what I'm saying or how I'm acting. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's not for you. You know what I'm saying? That's not for you to decide. It's for me to decide. You know what I'm saying? And if I can live with me, that's all that matters. But what I won't tolerate is any disrespect or any down talk from anybody. Not to be with a woman, not to have friends, not for anybody to like me. You know what I'm saying? I don't live that life. I don't need people like that. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not going to live in a disrespect. I'm not going to live like a coward. And I'm not going to live on my knees for nobody.